Inspiring Journey of Napoleon Bonaparte's Napoleon Bonaparte's life is one of the most captivating stories in history, filled with ambition, brilliant military strategies, and the rise and fall of an empire. His journey from a relatively obscure Corsican boy to Emperor of the French, and eventually one of the most iconic figures in world history, is truly inspiring. His determination, vision, and relentless pursuit of success left a lasting impact on Europe and the world. Born on August 15, 1769, in Corsica, Napoleon came from a modest noble family. His early life was shaped by the turmoil and conflicts of his homeland, which had recently been annexed by France. Despite his humble beginnings, he was sent to mainland France to receive a military education, where his sharp intellect and leadership skills became apparent. Napoleon's rise to prominence began during the French Revolution, which created an opportunity for talented individuals to rise quickly in the military ranks. In 1793, at the young age of 24, he made a name for himself during the Siege of Toulon, where his strategic genius helped reclaim the city from royalist forces. This victory earned him national recognition and set the stage for his rapid ascent through the military hierarchy. Napoleon's early military campaigns were nothing short of extraordinary. His Italian campaign, 1796 to 1797, is particularly notable for his ability to transform an ill-equipped and demoralized French army into a powerful force, defeating much larger and better equipped Austrian armies. His tactics were revolutionary, relying on speed, surprise, and the effective use of artillery. In Italy, he secured a string of decisive victories, and his leadership earned him the loyalty and admiration of his troops. These successes made him a national hero in France and demonstrated his potential to lead not just armies but entire nations. His ambition knew no bounds, and by 1799, he returned to France to take advantage of the political instability, orchestrating a coup d'état that made him first consul of France, effectively the country's leader. In 1804, Napoleon crowned himself emperor of the French, a bold move that symbolized his complete control over the nation. He embarked on a series of reforms aimed at stabilizing France and expanding its influence. His domestic reforms included the establishment of the Napoleonic Code, a set of civil laws that introduced principles like equality before the law, protection of property rights, and secular governance. The Napoleonic Code became a model for legal systems around the world and is considered one of his most enduring legacies. Napoleon also centralized administrative power improved the education system, and introduced reforms that helped modernize the French economy. His leadership turned France into the dominant power in Europe, and he began to pursue a vision of creating a unified European empire under French control. Napoleon's military campaigns, collectively known as the Napoleonic Wars, were a series of conflicts that reshaped Europe. His tactical brilliance was evident in battles like the Battle of Austerlitz in 1805, considered his greatest victory. In this battle, Napoleon's army defeated the combined forces of Austria and Russia, solidifying his dominance in Europe. His ability to outmaneuver and outthink his enemies earned him a reputation as one of the greatest military commanders in history. However, Napoleon's ambition eventually led to overreach. His decision to invade Russia in 1812 proved disastrous. The harsh winter and the Russian strategy of scorched earth warfare decimated his army and this marked the beginning of his decline. Despite this setback, Napoleon's resilience was remarkable. Even after suffering defeats, he managed to maintain his rule for a few more years, showcasing his determination and strategic thinking. In 1814, facing a coalition of European powers, Napoleon was forced to abdicate and was exiled to the island of Elba. Many believed this marked the end of his story, but Napoleon had other plans. In 1815, in one of the most dramatic comebacks in history, he escaped from Elba, returned to France, and regained power during what is known as the Hundred Days. His return was met with both fear and admiration, and he quickly rallied an army. However, his attempt to restore his empire was short-lived. In June 1815, at the Battle of Waterloo, Napoleon faced a coalition of British and Prussian forces led by the Duke of Wellington. Despite his tactical brilliance, he was ultimately defeated, marking the end of his reign. He was exiled once more, this time to the remote island of St. Helena in the South Atlantic, where he spent the remaining years of his life until his death in 1821.
Legacy. Napoleon's influence on the world is profound and far-reaching. His military innovations forever changed the nature of warfare, and his reforms in law, education, and administration left a lasting mark on France and beyond. The Napoleonic Code, in particular, became a foundation for legal systems not only in Europe but also in parts of the Americas and Africa. Napoleon's life is a testament to the power of ambition, resilience, and leadership. His story inspires because, despite his failures, he achieved incredible things through sheer willpower, intelligence, and an unyielding belief in his vision. He transformed France and Europe, and his name continues to evoke images of greatness, brilliance, and unmatched leadership. In the end, Napoleon's life teaches us about the complexity of ambition, its potential for both greatness and downfall. His journey from obscurity to the height of power, and his remarkable return from exile. Remains one of history's most compelling narratives. Napoleon Bonaparte, through his brilliance, determination, and audacity, left an indelible mark on the world that continues to inspire generations.